What is in that cage? Oh, it's a lamb. It's a sheep. Hi. We get to stay here for a while because we're in a traffic stop. Oh, your little ear is tagged. Maybe you are um, going to be somebody's um, sweater. It's that time again to see my pain management doctor, Carrie, and her nurse, Sarah, at their brand new clinic they just opened. If you want to be treated with financial responsibility, we can call you mm -hmm. payment. Yeah. What are you going to call me? <laughs> I'll call them, actually. No, no, what are you going to call me? I know. Yeah, call like, you. Call, what, like, or, like, Bozo? No. No. <laughs> no. 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 Yeah, no. Okay, this is my pain doctor, Carrie. <laughs> and we're going to sit down and talk. Shout out to some <laughs> <of> relief <laughs> care here in Jackson Hole, Wyoming. Big time. Okay, so I'm home now. It is exactly two o'clock in the afternoon. And um, I want to show you what Noodles did. It's no secret that Blue Dawn is an amazing dish soap, but also used for many, many other things. No oh, Dawn, bubbles! Dawn I love bubbles! Dish bubbles! Oh my God, I'm swimming in the bubbles! Oh, calamity Still girl. bubbles! <laughs> I'm Calamity Girl, and this is my point of view. I have three tomato plants that I am taking care of for my friend Sylvia until mid-October. And it was a challenge if I can keep them alive. And you know what? I have. Oh. Oh. It's so, it's so hard for me to pass up a... It's so hard for me to pass up a tomato. I'm do a south-facing mm -hmm. window. Look at little Mia, isn't she cute? Oh, I love her so much. Hi, Mimi. Mimi. Uh -huh. Say hi. Hi, Mimi. Mimi. <laughs> hi, baby. Hi, baby. I love you. Okay, well, anyway, I can talk to her all day. As you can tell, my friends are looking a little bit drab. But when I'm done with them, they're going to be fab. It's up to your knees out there. You really regret. I thrill when I touch what your hand. So, I'm going outside with my sander and my friends. And uh, we are going to um, give them a little bit of... We're taking them to the spa. Off to the spa. <laughs> and oh gosh, let me show you this. Okay, my friend Sylvia, I love her so much. And um, well, she asked me to take care of her tomato plants. Watch this. Okay, so she asked me to take care of her tomato plants. And I said, sure. And so I've since I've gotten them, I've really gotten them to thrive and everything like that. And so I, I've fallen in love with these tomato plants. Well... Um, it's a little too cold for the tomato plants now. It hasn't even gotten out of the 40s again today. Um, but, um, it, we're supposed to reach 70 by tomorrow. Fat chance. I think our temperatures are going down all the way from here, from here on out. But you know what? Um, <laughs> who's to say I need to talk about that right now when I want to show you something. Daylight's burning. <laughs> With the sander okay. and my friends who are t currently taking a nap because I was talking too long. Okay, here we go. Oh, hi. Hi. I didn't see you there. Oh. <laughs> did you see me? Yes, I did. Anyway, um, I am coming out here because my friends are getting a day at the spa. Ooh. All right, so I came over here to sit in the sunshine because it has been cold out. 
and so the sun, uh, this afternoon sun beats really hard, so it's nice. So anyway, um, I'm going to be um, doing my thing, so you can just stand there and watch if you want. Okay, thanks. Okay. Keep looking pretty. I can do that. Because you are. You're beautiful. You need a hug. I, I'm so happy to see you today. Aww. See, it's got spiky hair like I do. Yeah, it does. For a match. Mm, what? Ooh, oh, oh I, 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 I can make a couple of really nice end tables that with those. Nice I mean, really nice. Sorry. I'm looking at these. Let me see. I, I used to do art with, um, with wood. And uh, I'm looking at these giant logs over here. Wow. I'm like, oh my gosh. Instead of splitting um, all of them, maybe we can save one or two and I can make something nice out of that. Just a thought. That's all. Uh, just a thought. Okay. But let's make something nice out of the friends. You know, it's a bad day when you go into the doctor and he walks into the door and says, Hi, how are you doing today? <laughs> Make sure you use an oil such as a food grade mineral oil or a coconut oil. Those two oils will not go rancid and that's what you want. Okay, I did these two yesterday. And then now here's the rest of the family. Not bad, eh? They're not going back in the shape that they were in. I love these kids. No more dishwasher for them. My, uh, one of my subscribers, Lori Baird, gave these to me. Shout out to Lori Baird. She gave them to me for my birthday and I love them. Just vinegar, cleans like a champ. See you later. We're talking dish soap today. How come it says on here dishwashing liquid? Dishwashing liquid. But on the back it says for hand washing. There's nothing that it says about dishwashing. Your turn, same thing. Nothing about dishwashing. But if you go and you look at hand soaps, they're half the price of the dishwashing soap. So which is it, Don? Is it hand washing or dishwashing? If it's for hand washing, then it belongs in the hand washing aisle and you need to slash the prices. If it's for dishwashing, then you need to indicate that on the back. I'm, I'm Calamity Girl and this is my point of view. As you can tell, my friends are looking a little bit drab. <gasps> but when I'm done with them, they're going to be fab. Really? Just a little freshen up here. Anytime you treat any of your uh, utensils, cutting boards, anything like that, it's important to use a food grade oil. The most popular is a food grade mineral oil for cutting boards, things like that. Well, you can also use coconut oil. Once you get your oil on, make sure it can penetrate the wood a little bit and then just simply wipe it off with a paper towel. Aren't these gorgeous? They look even better from when I first got them. Oh, this guy is so dried out, but this guy is super happy now. I'm Calamity Girl. And this is my point of view. You like candy, you like bacon, let's put them together. Mm. Three cups of brown sugar. I'm putting a little maple and maple extract in this. Cookie sheet, tin foil, wire rack, oil, fresh 
cracked pepper, maple extract, and brown sugar. And you're gonna want to paste it on here. Make sure that it's all nice and covered. Please help me with my goal and subscribe to my channel. Do an exact repeat of what you did on the other side. Okay. I'll see you later.